Hi, this is Samato. In this video, we'll show you the game between Cristo Belzo and Nico Georgiadis. This is the game from Chess Olympiad that was played in Tromso in 2014. Cristo Belzo, played with white pieces, is representing Poland. And Nico Georgiadis is representing Switzerland. Christoph started with c4, the start of the English opening. And Nico played f5, Dutch defense. Knight to c3, knight to f6, g3, g6, bishop to g2, bishop to g7, d3, Nico castled kingside, e4, f takes on e4, d takes on e4, d6, knight on g to e2 c5, Christoph castled kingside, knight to c6, it is a way to move. h3 and f4 are two most played moves in this position. Christoph played bishop to g5, knight to g4, queen to d2, h6 attacking the bishop, bishop to f4, and Nico played g5. If, for example, bishop to d7, then after f3, knight must move and then bishop takes on h6. So we have g5, bishop to e3, black to move. What would you do? I think the first move that comes to mind is knight takes bishop. What do you think? But Nico had something different in mind and played queen to e8. h3, black to move. To take the bishop now, what is the best move for black in this position? Nico played knight from g to e5, threatening knight takes on c4 and another threat is bishop takes on h3 b3 defending the pawn on c4, bishop takes on h3, f4, if bishop takes bishop then knight to f3 check winning the queen. So we have f4, black to move, how should black continue? Bishop takes bishop is the best move, Nico played Queen to h5. Pawn takes knight. Knight takes on e5. And white is worried. For example, if knight to d5, then knight to f3 check. And after bishop takes, rook takes bishop. And after knight takes on e7 check, king to h8, and position fires black. So, Christoph wanted to close the f-file and played knight to f4, a desperate move. Pawn takes knight, pawn takes pawn, knight to g4, knight to d5, black to move. Knight takes bishop, knight takes knight. What happens if queen takes on e3? What would you do? Then bishop to d4, pinning and winning the queen. So we have knight takes knight, bishop takes rook, rook takes bishop, rook takes on f4, knight to f5, queen to g5, knight takes pawn on e7 check. King to h7 and white resigned. Possible continuation is knight to d5, then rook to g4, queen takes queen, rook takes queen, defending the bishop, adding one more attacker. And position is totally hopeless for white. 
That is why Krzysztof resigned in this position. And let's go back to the start. After C4, the English happening. How do you like this Dutch defense move? Interesting, isn't it? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.